you know one of the real advantages of making fast and dirty videos? They can still be very accurate, by the way. No editing. That's, that is when I find information and people want the answer to it, I can pound it out right away and upload it. Um, Fuji, X-T2 firmware. When I had my hands on pre-production Fuji, I had two cameras accessible to me. One was running firmware 1.00, and the other one was actually updated in front of me, and I was uh, using firmware 1.3.5. I confirmed later um, from uh, Fuji Rumors that uh, the guy there specifically, who will remain unnamed, but he's the honcho of Fuji Rumors, and he has access to people that have been using those cameras or pre-productions now for quite some time, that the last version of the pre-production firmware was 1.4.2. There could have been a slight one up from there that I don't know. The fact is, is that other people are asking about the uh, production version of the uh, Fuji X-T2. I was certain, but I wanted to confirm it, and I did get it confirmed from Fuji rumors and from a Fuji representative that, yes, indeed, you are not running old firmware on your Fuji X-T2. You will see that uh, if you hold on the back button and turn it on that you're rocking firmware version 1.00 on the body. That is because the production versions, whatever the pre-production version firmware was, they reset the clock to read 1.00 on the first release production retail sales version of the Fuji X-T2. So I've seen that question popped up uh, a, a good little bit, and so I thought I would address it and answer it. And uh, so no worries, you're rocking the latest firmware if you just got your Fuji X-T2, and you're not going to have to wait for that. Um, I've heard from Meridian Developer, and he said that uh, he ha will have the, uh, the full... I've got the beta version right now. Uh, he will have the full update for rocking uh, Fuji Rock Converter for a Radiant Developer, which is the best um, Fuji Rock Converter. And uh, he, he says on his uh, Twitter page that he will have a Windows version of a Radiant Developer out. I know a lot of people use Lightroom. Lightroom's great, Lightroom's wonderful, but Lightroom is definitely not the best Rock Converter for Fuji RAW files. Just flat out bar none. Test after test after test by independent people on the website, comparing everything shows that a Radiant Developer is number one, period. Lightroom doesn't touch it. Lightroom's a lot better than it used to be, but still, no, a Radiant is the best, period. No argument, no debate, there's no discussion, no opinion. That's the way it is. So, anyway, that's the information on the firmware. And um, let me know if you got any questions. I've been testing this uh, camera like a redheaded stepchild. I haven't had any sleep, basically. Well, I've had five hours of sleep over three days. And uh, I've, uh, you know, not been caressing the camera. I've been beating it around the gills. And uh, I've got a lot more information to post. And I can't do it all overnight. I have uploaded 22 videos in a matter of four hours very early this morning. 22 videos. Yeah. I might have had this camera for a while. No, no. I'll edit that out later. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>